take a full breath with me. So, yes, uh, yesterday the day was pretty bad, you can say. I wasn't able to work much on my studies and I wasn't able to, you know, work much on my development. So, particularly, I was a little sad. And in the night, something, you know, horrible happened, kind of bad happened in my family. And I was even more sad or devastated. And in the process, I fapped and I fapped four times. And, and yes, I'm ashamed of that in a way. Because now I'm feeling the sadness. Now I know for the next three days, I won't feel the happiness once again. I won't feel satisfied. My mind will be fidgeting all around. So I'm making this video <laughs> so that next time when I have this urge, I watch this video till the from the starting till the end so that I can know that what I should do after that and what are the consequences of my actions. First, let me ask myself like, why do I even want to do it? The simple answer to that is that I have no person or, or a girl, you can say. And second, I can say that I, I'm lonely kind of. I don't really share my emotions with anyone. And that's what causes a kind of, you know, the feedback loop of sadness and in turn which happened. Second, I have seen that I, you know, watch, watch porn and all these things when I'm particularly sad. I never do these things when I'm satisfied. And... So I really think that I need, should, I need to focus on, you know, minimizing these days where I don't feel like doing anything. It ruins my mental health. Now, watch this if you have a urge to fap. Why? Why do you want to do it? Is it really that pleasurable? Is it really that enjoying? Or is your brain just tricking you into believing things which you don't even want to do? Do you really want to live your life like a loser? What about your dreams which you had of becoming a millionaire, providing for your family, being a man? What happened to all those dreams? Were they just fallacies? Or were you true to them? Show the world how valuable your goals were to you. Sh most importantly, show yourself that you are not just a con artist. You are someone to be, you know, you are someone to be dealt seriously. Show your urges that you are in control, not them. Remember, in the future when you will have a son and when he would ask him that, what did you do in your days? You could proudly say that I utilize my days with the utmost efficiency and with sheer and with sheer magnitude of of work. You shouldn't have to say that I wasted my years. Remember, the world is yours to conquer. You just need to work hard and be able to be someone in God's eyes who God sees as a worthy person to give his gifts, you know. Remember that, yes, you can fall, but you shouldn't fall. You want to be the best, and that's why you can't make much mistakes on your path. Everyone has their time limited. Time is precious. You could leave life right now. Let that determine what you see and think. You need to understand that as a person and as a human being, there are certain good deeds and certain bad deeds which you must do and must refrain from. You need to understand the basic concept of life that is distinguishing between which is essential and which is not. 
at every moment of your life ask yourself is this essential you know and that's what i'm trying to say be a person who god deems worthy enough to be to give his gifts you believe in god fear god uh, but also have faith in god that whatever you are doing god will reward it one day don't believe in the world in the world in the darkness in the world which lies see the light behind the horizon of the black clouds don't be used by pains use pain to evolve and to be a greater human being to be a superior man this is the purpose of your life to be a good citizen of good character and virtues who works for the common good remember your actions remember to control your actions because your actions fuck remember to control your thoughts because your thoughts control your actions and your actions control the acts which you do always be congruent on what you are thinking on what you are on what you are subconsciously you know taking in and taking out always try to be right you try to make beautiful choices you can have the world you just need to take it god has already given you the world you just need to work hard and take it be a good son for the god be the best person god has ever created make him proud most of self make yourself proud you can be great you can be great today instead you choose tomorrow you know you need to win but you back it off you know you need to study but you back it off nothing happens if nothing happens if you really care about your dreams try to make it a success try to make your life as a success so that at 20 at 80 years of age when you are looking back at your life the only product which you have is yourself the memories you have created the man you have become try to be a person who everyone respects and most of most importantly you respect try to be a better human being who acts for the common good be a humble person a strong man strong caring man because weak time uh, hard times are coming and hard times create strong men weak times create weak men remember you need to be able to be a man capable enough so that your future wife can be free so that she doesn't have to commute in early in the morning so that she doesn't have to work you need to be you need to be able to provide to the family so that she can live her life freely so that you can retire your father so that you can mother your mother can finally live happily without any tension remember you have a goal in life you are not unique but you need to become unique you are not inherently unique but you can be unique and how by your actions you can be i trust you god trusts you even though you have made so much mistakes in the past even today yesterday day before yesterday one week ago you have made so much mistakes but still there are two people who still believe in you you yourself and god god has send you on this earth to be a force for the good prove him right prove him that he was right to care to be, to make his accept expectations of you concentrate like a roman be the best man you can be yes take care